Hi there guys, it's Chris here with SelfMadeNewbie.com and in this video we're going to go through the best smart light switches currently out there today. So no matter what kind you're looking for, there'll definitely be something in this video. So before we jump in, drop a like, subscribe and turn on that bell if you want to be updated with new videos. All right, so I'm gonna skip the fluff as usual and just dive into my recommendations. And if you wanna confirm what they are, you can check the description there uh, for my list, for my recommendations, as well as the best pricing. So jumping right into my first choice, and this is the recommendation for the best smart light switch with a motion sensor. And this is the Leviton Decora Smart Wi-Fi Motion Sensing Dimmer. So this one is probably my favorite overall. It has a clean look and simple design, so it's great for those who want tech, but you don't want it to look too gadgety, I guess. You can set specific dimming levels for the times of day, and you can handle a wide range of lights, including LEDs, CFLs, um, incandescent, and magnetic low voltage as well. It also supports a large number of smart home platforms, including Alexa, Google Home, and Apple Home Kit. However, this does require a neutral wire, so this might be an issue for older homes. Uh, and if you don't care for a motion sensor, uh, there's also a dimmer only version and an on off only version switch uh, among their line as well. So what I liked about this uh, works with Amazon Alexa, Google Home and Apple. Uh, simple clean design, doesn't look too gadgety and it doesn't require a hub or controller. It connects directly to Wi-Fi. Uh, but again, as I said, the only con is you do require that neutral wire. The next one on my list is another great option for Alexa and Google Assistant with a motion sensor, and this is the GE Sync Smart Switch. Now this doesn't look as good as the last one, but it is a great light switch because it gets the job done and there, it is packed with a bunch of features. So the Wi-Fi connected switch works with all kinds of bulbs, has apps for iOS and Android, and lets you control lights with a touch, with voice, with, vo with motion, or remotely via your smartphone. Um, the insulation requires a neutral wire again, but it's quite straightforward. This switch also includes an ambient light sensor, uh, so it can be set to not come on in daytime, for example, and a motion sensor to automatically trigger the light. The latter feature uh, works really well, so if you turn it off with the switch, after a few minutes it will engage the motion sen sensor again, or you can disable the sensor via the app. So this also responds to voice commands, but the Sync Android app needs some work, in my opinion. Setting up automation for a room can be a little bit confusing, and it can even be difficult to tell when you've scheduled it to go on and off. So this is also a little bit more expensive than some of the others on this list. Now what I do like, uh, no hub necessary, supports Alexa and Google Assistant, and also the motion sensor works really well. I don't really like the techie design, and also the app was a little bit confusing, to be honest. The next one on my list is my recommendation for a high-tech touchscreen um, that lets you control multiple devices, not only your lights, and this is the Brilliant Control Panel. So this touchscreen light switch lets you control not only your lights, but also other smart devices like cameras, speakers, and other things. The panel has a large touchscreen which uh, you can use to look in on your security cameras, for example, play music through smart speakers, and it has a touch sensitive slider uh, on one side, and that's a simple way to change the brightness of the lights. Uh, Brilliant also sells models with multiple sliders. Um, in addition, the panel has built-in motion sensors, so you can turn the lights on and off as you enter and leave the room. There's a small camera which lets you use multiple panels as video intercoms, and uh, the panel also works with a wide range of smart home systems like Alexa, Google, Siri, Ring, August, it could be Honeywell, Sonos, Philips Hue, and also Genie. So what I like about this one is the really beautiful interface. You don't need a subscription, Alexa is built in, but because of all those features that it offers, it is a little bit on the expensive side. So what I like about this one is the really beautiful interface. You don't need a subscription, Alexa is built in, but because of all those features that it offers, it is a little bit on the expensive side. The next one on my list is a great option if you want it to work with a big range of smart home devices. And this is the Lutron Casita. This one uh, is a, has an impressive list of features as well. 
it has geofencing, which means your lights will automatically turn on and off when you leave or arrive home. The ability to schedule your lights to turn on and off at different times, has dimming capabilities and compatibility with a long list of home platforms. So you can use Amazon Alexa, Google Home and Siri and other smart home systems as well. So this smart starter kit comes with one in-wall switch, one wireless remote and one smart bridge or a hub uh, which can be used to connect other Lutron products to the cloud and control them as well. Now the switch itself looks very high tech. It has several buttons laid out to control the numerous options that Casita offers um, and has gone for function over fashion for most part though with this dimmer. Uh, the white and gray buttons are front and center. They're not hidden by touch sensitive controls as is the case uh, with other dimmers in this category which look a little bit better. Now what I like about this, the wide range of features, really good customer service as well from Lutron. Um, supports three-way switches as well. The reasons I don't like it, a bit pricey again, and it also requires a hub or a smart bridge. Now the next one on my list is another great option for a smart dimmer, and this is the Legrand Smart Dimmer Switch. So this Legrand switch gets pretty close to a universal light switch as it can communicate with all of the main smart home systems like Apple, Alexa, Google Home, but there is no direct support for IFTTT or Zigbee devices. And that universal moniker also applies to what is controlling uh, with Legrand claiming that it auto detects and collaborates with LED CFL halogen incandescent and EFL bulbs it can control up to 450 watt of LED and CFL or 700 watt of halogen and incandescent which should cover most light sources. The paddle switch itself has a nice clicky feel to it but it is smaller than most. Those who like to bash paddle switches with the side of their hand may prefer the larger Leviton Decora switches. Um, next to the main switch is a dimmer switch along with several small white LEDs to show the dimming level. So what I like about this one, it can controls LED CFL and incandescent dimmable bulbs. It works with multiple smartphone sys smart home systems, sorry. Um, but reason to avoid is it's a little bit expensive and the small buttons I wasn't really a big fan of either. All right guys, so those are my absolute top five picks. So if you want something with a touch screen, something with a camera, something that looks good, something that's more techy looking, hopefully there's something on this list for you. But if you have any questions, drop them below. And if you got value from this video, it really helps out if you drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Take care.